These photographs are of de Havilland Canada DHC1 Chipmunk T Mark 10 G BB MV. The de Havilland Aircraft Canada Company was formed in 1928 as a subsidiary of the British de Havilland Aircraft Company. DHC produced many of its parent company's aircraft before launching their first indigenous aircraft, the DHC-1 Chipmunk. The Chipmunk's de Havilland lineage can be seen in the shape of the vertical stabiliser and rudder and the use of the 142 horsepower de Havilland Gypsy Major 1C engine driving a fixed pitch two-bladed propeller. The airframe is of all metal stress skin construction but with fabric covering on parts of the wings and the control surfaces. The crew of instructor and student occupy tandem cockpits covered by a one-piece sliding canopy. The prototype Chipmunk first flew in May 1946 and delivery of 218 aircraft for the Royal Canadian Air Force began in 1948. 735 Chipmunk T Mark 10s powered by the Gypsy Major 8 engine were supplied to the Royal Air Force for primary flying training. The British version was fully aerobatic and was fitted with a multi-panelled sliding canopy rather than the bubble type that was typical in Canada. Another 217 chipmunks were built for export sale and 60 were built under licence in Portugal. The chipmunk enjoyed a very long and successful military service life. Its performance and handling qualities were ideal for pilot instruction and it proved itself a rugged, reliable aircraft. As well as being used by RAF flying training schools, chipmunks were widely operated by University Air Squadrons and Cadet Air Experience Flights and some were based at RAF stations for general communications use. Uniquely, a chipmunk based at RAF Gatow was used for operational intelligence gathering and reconnaissance missions over Berlin during the Cold War. The RCAF did not retire its last chipmunk until 1972 and it continued in RAF service until 1996. Most were then disposed of, but two chipmunks operated by the Battle of Britain Memorial Flight were kept for training pilots on tailwheel aircraft. Ex-military chipmunks have proved popular because they're delightful to fly. Many are still airworthy in private ownership and will be seen in the skies for years to come. This particular aircraft, WG348, was built in 1951 and was first operated by number 2 Reserve Flying School at RAF Barton in Manchester. Between 1953 and 1964, WG348 was operated by a series of reserve flying schools and university air squadrons. It was transferred to the Central Flying School in 1964, where it was used by the Skylark's aerobatic team, remaining there until 1969. Its military service ended in 1973, when it was sent to number 5 maintenance unit at RAF Kemble for disposal. In October 1973 it was issued civilian registration GBBMV. These photographs can be purchased as a set of JPEGs at www.trapletshop.com.